All right, so this is going to be a Costco sale item review of these Blue Diamond Almonds, bold Korean barbecue flavored. All right, so normal price of this, $14.99. It was $4.50 off, so basically $10.50. All right, let's go ahead and take a look. Ketogenic certified. All right, you can see it has a resealable zipper. I just got to tear along there. Intense taste, smart snacking. All right. Uh, what's that? 45 ounces, 2 pounds, 13 ounces, or 1.3 kilograms. Uh, scientific evidence suggests, but does not prove, that eating 1.5 ounces per day of most nuts, such as almonds, as part of a diet low in saturated fat and cholesterol, may reduce the risk of heart disease. See nutrition information for fat content. All right. UPC code on the bottom. And here we go. There's also a UPC code here for easy scanning. Consistent quality, bold flavors, and great value. Blue Diamond Growers uh, delicious Korean barbecue almonds are roasted and seasoned with zesty, bold flavors. So satisfying that you just can't put them down. Korean barbecue is the perfect combination of sweet and tangy with just a little bit of spice. These almonds provide a mouth-watering pop for your snacking enjoyment. Enjoyment. <laughs> and our convenient... <laughs> What? And our convenient resealable bag gives you the option to save some for later, if you can. I'm sure I'll be able to save some for later. <laughs> Let's see. From the Hellman people. If you have questions or comments, they have their information there. Uh, ingredients are, obviously, almonds, Korean-style barbecue seasoning, which is cane sugar, salt, corn, uh, corn maltodextrin, garlic powder, tomato powder, paprika, yeast extract, onion powder, cayenne pepper, citric acid, spices, molasses, canola oil, Acetic acid, paprika extract, natural flavor, sunflower oil, natural smoke, and natural smoke flavor. Then there's vegetable oil, uh, which is made from almond, canola, safflower, and or sunflower oil. All right. This contains tree nuts, obviously, almonds. So if you're allergic to those, be careful. Um, this is made with almonds from California, and it's distributed by Blue Diamond Growers in Sacramento, California. This is best before January 15, 2025. This was purchased um, September 22nd, 2023. So yeah, that's over a, over a year and a half, right? Okay, here you go. Servings are actually not over a year and a half, huh? Uh, a year and four months, three, four months. All right, 45 servings per container. Anyway, serving size, one ounce. 170 calories per serving, 50 grams of fat, 20%, saturated fat, 1 gram, 6%, polyunsaturated fat, 3.5 grams, monounsaturated fat, 10 grams, uh, 150 milligrams of sodium, 6%, carbs, 5 grams, 2%, fibers, uh, 3 grams, 10%, 2 grams of sugar, which includes less than 1 gram of added sugar. Then there's 80 milligrams of calcium, 6%, 1 milligram iron, 6%, potassium, 180 milligrams, 4%, vitamin E, 71 milligrams, 45%, magnesium, 70 milligrams, 15%. All right, let's go ahead and open this up and give them a taste. So it has this tear line here. Probably want to tear along that. Okay, it didn't completely tear right. So we're going to go this way as well. All right, first off, you have the seasoning powder everywhere because they didn't zip this up. So the seasoning powder is up in the Ziploc area. But uh, yeah, it looks very, very well seasoned, heavily seasoned. Let's see how it tastes. So come on, focus on the almonds. There you go. I don't know, it doesn't want to focus. There you go. All right, so let's grab it. Let's give it a sniff. Kind of smells like um, Lay's barbecue chips, but let's give this a try. Hmm, tastes garlicky. Is that what I'm tasting, garlic? Pretty salty. It's like um, garlic, green onion, or I don't know. It's hard to describe. <laughs> I don't think it tastes like specifically Korean barbecue, but they are pretty tasty. Mm-hmm. Have a slight sweetness to them as well. Sweet, salty, savory. Pretty nice. Mm-hmm. Yeah, these are pretty enjoyable. When I eat it, if I was given this and not told the flavor, I don't know if I would say um, 
Korean barbecue, but yeah, they are tasty. So if you see these at your Costco, I recommend you give them a try. They're pretty good. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you all in the next one. Bye.